More than 155,000 federal workers went on strike in Canada in what their union is calling one of the largest strikes in the country's history. Here's what this means. The labor disruption is expected to impede government functions, including the release of economic data and passport and immigration applications. The Public Service Alliance of Canada said the strike was called after talks with the government failed to produce an agreement. Wage increases are the main issue. The union has been seeking a 13.5% raise over three years for Treasury Board employees. Tax workers are looking for 20.5% over three years, plus an immediate 9% adjustment. The stakes are high for Prime Minister Justin Trudeau, whose government has increased the size of public service by more than a third since being elected in 2015. The two sides are expected to continue negotiations throughout the strike.